The meeting with the state workforce across various ministries by Governor Dapwabiodun could be likened to a town hall meeting which afforded the workers an opportunity to interact with Governor Biodun and his deputy, Noimot Salako Yedele. The civil servants rode out the drums to officially welcome the new governor. The civil servants were led by the head of service, Larry Bisiriu, to the arcade ground where the governor took time to listen to the plights of workers, ministry by ministry. The asking is serious, but we want you to tell us, how are you going to do it? We know we, we may not be expecting everything at once. We will be clear the system, but tell us here, and we believe you. The governor, Prince Dapwabiodun, reiterates his commitment to the welfare of workers, including the payment of salary arrears and build their capacity for the much needed human capital development. We have realized that we can, within the next one year, not only begin to feed ourselves in the state, but we can begin to export food to the neighboring states. By so doing, by so doing, we would have employed our team youth as well. So we'll do that by having farm settlements that have been tested, proven and worked in other countries. Those farm settlements will employ our roots. We will employ them by making sure that they have facilities that will interest them. He promised to stimulate local economy, establish Ogun State Industrial Promotion Agency and Security Trust Fund in addition to actualizing the proposed Ogun Lagos Joint Commission in order to tap the benefits of the proximity to Lagos. The governor assured the workers that his stand on the new minimum wage will be communicated to workers soon.